Hi everyone, so in today's video I'm talking about the Chanel quality decrease after talking about the Chanel price increase yesterday. So I have quite a lot of Chanel handbags. The earliest one um, I got vintage at the vintage store and it's from like 1983 and the latest that I got, I got last year so in 2020 at the Chanel store. And while now those bags are like 37 years apart and you can actually tell the quality difference like a lot. So I will first show you my oldest Chanel handbag and then I will just show you like the ones between and then my latest Chanel handbag and then um, I will just explain a little bit about the quality differences. I will not go into fabric handbags. It's the leather quality is probably something that um, you see the difference like the most. So let's just start right away because we have a lot to cover. So the oldest Chanel handbag that I have, it's like way older than I am. I'm 25. This is 38 years old. So pretty old for a handbag. And I think it actually looks great. I mean, yeah, you can see that the gold, um, the, uh, I'm, oh, what I have to say is before I think 2010, 2012, no, before 2012, like the hardware was like gold plated. So those, this hardware is so gold plated and you can see, I mean, you can see a little bit of the tarnishing, but I could clean that easily. And I will just show you up close. So you see, there is a little bit of tarnishing, but on the hardware, but if you look at the letter, I mean it's lambskin letter and it actually looks pretty insane, I have to say. So not only is the hardware like premium, like upper premium quality, um, also the lambskin letter was a lot more durable. Um, in the early days, not early days for Chanel, I mean Chanel existed a long time before that, but from the earlier Chanel handbags, the lambskin leather is much better quality, much more durable, and therefore I always suggest, if you are scared of buying a lambskin handbag, I would say if you buy a new lambskin handbag, I can totally understand, but if you buy a vintage Chanel handbag, like from the 80s, from the 90s, you have to keep in mind that the lambskin leather there was a lot, a lot more durable. I mean, I have this bag now for about, I think I got it like five years ago or something like that. And I used it like a lot. I don't baby my bags at all. I, I never, I seriously never do that because I think you have to enjoy wearing the handbags and you have to enjoy wearing all of your things. I don't believe in saving something for special occasions. I mean, make every day a special occasion because those things are so pretty and they are so expensive and they are too expensive to not use like daily. So I wear this bag when it rains. Like this bag got caught in a lot of rain storms because I live in Switzerland and we have a lot of rain, let me tell you. And yeah, it still looks very nice. The only thing is that it loses its shape a little bit. You can see it here on the side. Like there you can see that it's not a new bag, it's an old bag. But still, I mean, for me, it's a great handbag. Like it's my handbag that like goes through everything like traveling, rain, storms, just you can't go wrong with this one. So premium quality, like really super quality. And that's also the reason why a lot of winter Chanel handbags are actually quite expensive because you not only pay for Chanel but you also pay for like the premium quality and you can't get that anymore because let me tell you they aren't as good anymore they are good but not as good and then I will just show you another one this one is from the early 90s 
and still all of the lambskin leather handbag, all of the, I mean, this bag, I use it so, so, so much. And if you look here, this is the gold um, hardware here. There's like nothing. It's like perfect. It's so shiny. It's still perfect. Also, the leather is actually like impeccable. Like if, if someone would tell me that this bag is like two or three years old, I would believe them like totally because it's actually insane. I also have some tips on how to care for your Chanel handbags and I will show them in the next video. But I don't do a lot of things to my handbags and yeah, that's just the old Chanel quality which is absolutely insane. Then, this handbag from Chanel, I got that in a store I think like seven years ago or eight years ago and I used that as a school bag, as a uni bag with my heavy books, my heavy um, my heavy books, my heavy laptop even and this also still looks quite good so I actually just realized that I never took the stickers off. That's probably why it looks that good. <laughs> I mean, how could I realize that they're blue right now? They probably got blue because I never took them off for eight years. So, <laughs> if you look here, here, this is the sticker. So, the hardware on this is obviously still good. But I think actually, if you look at it, even though, like here, in this chain or something like that, it still looks good, but it's a different kind of gold. It's a lot more just like shiny gold. It does because it's not gold plated. It's just it's not the 24 karat gold um, that the old Chanel handbags have. So you see, it looks it still looks nice. The quality is good, but also like the shape of the carrier handbag is not as immaculate as like the lambskin shape. And actually, lambskin is supposed to sag a lot more easy. So yeah, there you can see kind of already the difference. And now I will show you my Chanel Trendy CC, which I got in 2020. And don't get me wrong, I love this handbag so much. I think the color is so special. I love the trendy shape. I think it's so beautiful. And this shape, you can't get it vintage because it isn't that old. So here it is, my Chanel Trendy. And I have to say, I got this bag a year ago and I, I used it quite a bit, but not so much. And the lambskin leather is delicate, so I have to be so careful with this handbag, like a lot more careful than I have to be with like my other ones, my old ones. And yeah, again, I mean, I see, I, you can see scratches a lot more easy, but it still looks great like it's only a year old and we are wearing lockdown like most of this but you can see the difference I think you can see the difference like the most if you look at the gold hardware here you see it's again this like very shiny shiny gold not like this old gold like you see that it's not 24 karat um, real gold and here you can see that leather it's very good but yeah also I think I think you can even see it in the stitching because there sometimes are some small little threads um, which I again haven't seen in the old Chanel handbags so for me if you can get a Chanel handbag vintage and it's in a great condition I would totally suggest you that especially now that the price has increased so much so I actually would be fast because after price increases it usually doesn't take a long time until the pre-loft market goes up in price as well so I would suggest you that and otherwise just you have to just take a little bit of better care for your handbag and again I will make a video on that and that was everything for today's video I will see you guys in the next one bye